Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at some self-defence applications from Siam Chin, one of the katas in our syllabus. Um, so there is a sequence of moves, the first part here. Um, so it comes in here, and the hands come up, and it brings down. There's a move here, pushes through like that. Okay, so we're just going to look at that um, and use some of those moves um, that would be applicable in self-defense. Sometimes people can get really bogged down um, in making it look like a kata. I like to get bogged down in something that would help you out and would work. All right? So we're going we're gonna to borrow Jack. We're going to take it from, it could be a double wrist grab, it could be a single wrist grab, it doesn't really matter. But it's this first move, the hands scoop up like this, and you grab the meat of the thumb, like that. I'll show you on the other side so you can see. So you grab the meat of the thumb right there. That's very important, good grip. And then, when you turn it down, you sort of hyperextend the wrist and the elbow. It's really painful. And Jack's a really flexible guy, and that's really hurting him, so uh, very effective. So, go on the other side, you come up to here, you put it down just like the cat hat. Like that, all right? Now there's lots of different things you can do here. The part of the cat of the hand comes up like this, so we, can, we could have an arm bar in like that, and you've got control of them, all right? And, or the hand comes up like this, so you could strike in, bang, like this, or like that, into the neck. Um, and then you've got this move here, which for me, I think that's a palm strike, so we could go bang on the nose or on the chin, like that, all right? Now, there's a few things in there that would be very effective on their own. Alright, so let's just think through those three. So it's here, grab the meat of the thumb, peel it down, and you get a joint lock. Alright, okay. Then we get another one if you want to do that. The arm bar like that. Then you've got a strike, bang, and then another strike there. And the last part is you step through into this part again, don't you? So you step behind, and you've got it like that. All right, so with, with the uh, with the throw, we've got on this side so you can see. So we've got in here, just some bang like that. You step, and it's very important that you drop, because that's what's going to help you um, bring your partner down. All right, so you want to use the technique. This hand here on the shoulder, grab hold somewhere, yeah, wherever you can, find a grip, and drop. Put the hip in. That's what gets you know, the, the technique. So if you're a smaller person, you can bring someone larger down. All right? So watch all together. There you have it. Give it a go. Be careful with your partner. Thanks very much.